What? This speech we spoke of our excuse? Or shall we on without an apology? The date is out of such proximity. We will have no cupid hoodwink with a scar. But let them measure us by what they will. We will measure them a measure and be gone. Dear Romeo, we must have you dance. Not I, believe me. You have dancing shoes with nimble soles. I have a soul of lead, so it takes me to the ground, I cannot move. You are a lover, Romeo. Borrow Cupid's wings. And soar with them above a common bound. Under love's heavy burden, do I sink? And to sink in it, should you burden love to great operation for a tender thing? Is love a tender thing? Too rough, too rude, too boisterous to think. It pricks like thorn. If love be rough with you, be rough with love. Quick love for pricking, and you beat love now. Come, knock and enter, and no sooner in, but every man betake him to his legs. And we mean well in going to this mask. Why may one ask? I dreamed a dream tonight. And so did I. While they do dream things true. True. I talk of dreams, which are the children of an idle brain, beggared of nothing but vain fantasy. Which is as thing or substance as the air, and moving constant than the wind, which rules even now the frozen bosom of dawn, and being angered, puffs away from them, turning his face, the dew dropping south. Somebody is done, and we shall come too late. I fear too early. For my mind misgives some consequences yet hanging in the stars. Shall bitterly begin his fearful debt. With this night reveals and expire the term of a despised love closed in my breast. By some vile forfeit of untimely death. But he that hath the steerage of my course direct myself. On, lusty gentlemen.